Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Markisha with Mark Chat, and today we're going to do a plan with me in my Hobonichi weeks for the week of September 5th through 11th. So let's get started. All right, so today I'm just going through all of my stickers, and I found I don't know if you guys have this. This is from Walmart. This was you can see the washi that's still on there. It's actually um, it was a gift from a Secret Santa. They knew I loved planning. This was from a while back. I think it says copyright 2018, but I think it, I actually got this maybe two years ago, something like that. I don't know. And um, I like to, when I don't have sticker kits for my Hobonichi Weeks, if, if this is your first time watching, I like to utilize washi tape and things like that to cover this. So I'm gonna get started with that. And inside of here I found, let's see, some cute washi. It's kind of a pink color. It has floral design on there. I know it's summertime. I'm here in Texas and I don't even know, like with this weather, I cannot tell you what season it is. It is rainy, it is cloudy. All of a sudden the sun is beaming out and it is the most gorgeous weather and then it turns windy again and <laughs> I could not tell you what season it is. It looks like all of a sudden we're going through April showers and then all of a sudden we're going through uh, a little fall spell, which is exciting. Then all of a sudden it looks like um, we're going back into the spring. I, I don't know. And, and and on top of that, it's, it's pretty much hot every day. <laughs> so, um, and I like to just end it right here in this washi right here and then just cut or I have like a, let me see, a EK tools and I can use this. I mean, there's different things. Um, I may just do this with scissors, I don't know. I don't wanna be too much of a, of a perfectionist with this. I just kinda like to go with the flow. I wonder if I can just rip this. Yeah, mm -hmm. yep, ripping, ripping work. Good, because this this is a EK Tools a slice kind of tool you can see, and it's good um, for cutting things and cutting washi and things like that. But then sometimes it's sliced through this thin um, paper that the Hobonichi Weeks has, and so I like to kind of um, deter from using that inside of here. All right, and then on top of that, I like to cover kind of give you a little sneaky peeky, um, <laughs> cover it and use, like you can see the numbers of the dates there and the day. So I like to mimic that over here, but make it decorative. And just kind of looking through this sticker book cause I like to, I want to use up my stash people. I don't want to sit here and have a billion, well, I, oh, okay, well, I'm lying to y'all now. I do want to have a billion sticker books, um, but I, want to use them. Um, I want to actually utilize them. I want to actually uh, do things with them. And um, so, yeah, um, let's just see if this is dark enough. I'm kind of, I don't know, let me see. I mean, I could do like you know, different colors on there and that would be fine. Can kind of, can y'all see that? Hmm, yeah. You know what, at first I was gonna use, um, I literally was gonna use like uh, just one color. And I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna use every color <laughs> that's here. And we're gonna see what magically works out and what doesn't, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna go over it with a black pen and write the dates over it anyways. So it honestly does not matter. How are y'all doing today? Uh, so far I'm doing fine, I don't know if some of you guys are coming back to the channel or new people, uh, welcome, welcome. Um, I remember, you know, I was talking about, you know, I, I talk a lot about back to school because that's what's going on in my life. I have a six year old and um, earlier on or like last week, she was just like in this mood of, I don't wanna go back to school. I wanna stay at home with mommy, that kind of thing. Well, I would love to report, well, I am reporting to y'all that she is back to enjoying school. I think that um, 
one of the days in school, uh, she wasn't feeling well and she came home and she was playing around and having fun. Um, I'm using this alphabet book to do like the Monday through Sunday. So, but just going back to the story or what's going on, she um, just wanted to just stay at home. Just wanted to stay at home and hang out with mommy. And I was like, nope, mommy still has to go to work. Mommy still has to do things just like you. You can't stay home with mom and dad and play around and stuff. I wonder if this blue will show up on here. Let me try that and see. I can always rip it up and that's okay. Um, but I, I just, now she's back to going to school. You can kind of see that, that's fine. I, I'll, I can live with that, I can see it. Uh, if y'all can't see it, I'll pull I'll pull it up a little bit so y'all can kind of see. I'm just you you know just want to know what day it is. Is it Monday? Is it Tuesday? <laughs> that kind of thing. And it's actually cute. It's matching this. Let me see. Where's W? Uh oh. B. Do I have another alphabet book? I know I do somewhere. That's magical. Of course, of course, we're starting to run through all of the random letters. Here's my second one. O M G. <laughs> why do I have so many I'm telling you I have a lot of sticker books and over time I I'm sure you guys are just like me you go to the store and you're like ah, it's almost like candy <laughs> you're there and you see these uh books and you're like oh that's cute I would love to put that in my planner and then you just buy the whole book because it's on sale at Michael's or Joann's or wherever you're going and then it just sits on the shelf looking at you like use me and you're just like ah but I'm, I'm i'm really loving this book that i have here and you use up that book and then it's just just hopping around just having fun with some stickers um and the alphabet one of course um actually my daughter she likes to use it um in her arts and crafts and so the alphabet was a big one and she likes to use the alphabet so i ended up with two and i think i bought one of them like in years past um it was on sale like it was on deep clearance or sale or something like that and i ended up with two so and there we go i don't know if y'all can see it you can kind of see it all i did just cover up the numbers cover up with letters hey i don't have a sticker um what do you call it a kit but that's fine you just keep rolling with it so my you know back to what i was talking about my daughter's enjoying school which is great and everything's wonderful. So I like to do like a kind of a to-do at the top because I've tried multiple different ways of using my Hobonichi Weeks. And honestly, this has been the best way to use it by just, you know, I have big handwriting. I mean, I wanna write the top three things there and I end up with one thing there. And it's just like, okay, well, uh, let me try and do this way or, you know, trying different things. I should let y'all see what's inside this book. It's actually really cute. Um, and I'm over here flipping and just talking and y'all are like, girl, I can't see anything you, <laughs> anything you're doing. Um, but I'm actually looking for to see if it's like a to do thing somewhere. Look at this. Look, I mean, it has leather, I mean, leather, weather decals i'm always looking for weather um stuff i had that all that whole time i could i can rip it out and just use it and um i have a what do you call it a uh you know the sticker book that you can put different stickers inside of it i have that coming in the mail once that comes in maybe i'll do a video and we can kind of um go over it together and it, look look i can't find it to do but you know what let's not waste much time i see banners somewhere hmm do i want to use that banner there's so many cute things in here now i'm, I'm like okay don't want to use that or some polka dots or something something plain all i'm gonna do is write to do on it i am feeling ah, so many choices right <laughs> why is it so difficult why am i making it so difficult it's like i want all the stickers but I, i'm just like no okay going with this I ripped it up and look, it matches. Yay, sort of, kind of, and it's not going to be perfectly in the middle. Um, and I'm okay with that. There we go. All right. And then another sticker that's kind of more 
I wonder if I can get something that I can write the to-do on. I wonder if I, maybe if I just use one of these banners on top of it, maybe, like this blue one, like on top. Uh, and then just kind of write to-do. I mean, it's not the best choice, but it is a choice and I've made it and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> so let's see. And then I like to um, just do like a top, like five maybe uh, things. I wonder if this is, this would be one, two, three, four, five. Like this doesn't really go with that. I mean, it does, but it doesn't. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to make it to, I mean, I can use the stars, but it's like flowers. And now I'm over here like, I'm over here like, hmm, got these check marks. I like check marks. All right, and I can do multiple colors. And I wonder if I want to be all extra matchy matchy because it goes with the colors there. But you know what? No, we're not doing that. We are just going to go with the flow and we're just going to put it down. And I'm going to utilize check marks. Looks like I started using these checks in the past and I, I went against it. So there. And I'm just going to go with five and I'm sure y'all have like other sticker books that legit has the same stuff inside of it and you guys can just go with the flow find something some check marks some stars some hearts some anything a dot I mean and and if you don't have stickers that's okay too just I I, I usually uh draw like let me see three six let's go for the lucky number seven why not it seems like I keep going with this blue sticker. But I mean, I will literally sit there and draw like a little square and just check it off and that's fine. But I like to add some color, you know, to my life sometimes. And you know, that's fun. Um, and I plan on doing more uh, plan with me's uh, for this weekly. I noticed that I'm posting it like almost towards the end of the week. And um, I think I'm going to start doing, I may do like the next week too and post that as well so that we can get kind of like ahead of the game. But I just was like, I'm doing this weekly thing and I think it would be fun to do it along with y'all. Hydrate. I started this whole channel on hydration, if y'all don't know, which is hilarious. And I don't know why it has been difficult it's not difficult. Look, I'll get through half of the amount of water that I'm supposed to drink, which, what is it? 60 ounces. And then I will literally um, do the 30 ounces or something like that, or 20, 40 ounces. And then that last 20, I don't know if I start, I think I start later in the day and that's not the best thing. So I probably should not do that. And I should probably uh, drink my water more on... Um, you know, starting in the morning instead of like after 12. And then also I like to put, let's see, the weather here. Cause this is something sometimes I'll throw it inside of my uh, bag and sometimes, you know, I'll, I won't and that's fine. So I'm gonna write, and it's like literally forecasted rain all week long and I do not know why. I mean, well, I mean, I guess I do know why. Nature, it's called nature. 84, 75, and I just take this off of, um, I just take this off of my um, my weather app. You know, if you got an iPhone, it has the weather and legit it will change throughout the day. It will change um, throughout the week. All of a sudden, I'm looking at this and it said rain and it's not raining. I like to just kind of know. I'm on. I'm honestly doing this for like the variances in the weather and um, what do you call it? Um, I want to know if it's raining. And it used to be hit or miss rain, but the weather nowadays has been um, rain every day forecasted. And like legit yesterday, it got super dark, windy. Um, started raining like it was a hurricane about to happen and then all of a sudden the sun shined and then um some friends of mine um like maybe five miles away um at another location of my job literally lost power for the rest of the night like it was just like insane like why <laughs> it was like 
everything's fine over here. Like the, you know, I saw a little flicker in the, in the electricity, but you know, in the lights, but it wasn't anything major. But now y'all are literally losing power to everything. And that is not okay. So um, that's what was going on. I might as well, I mean, look at these little weather decals. They're so cute. It's just a different weather. Can't use the sunshine because it's raining. Uh, thunderstorm, sure. Uh, <laughs> uh, might as well put that down. Um, you know, it's just raining the entire week. And it, it just like, literally, it will rain. I don't even know. If this is this snow or is this rain? I'm gonna act like it's rain in my head, but y'all see this? Is that snow or rain? I guess they're like, hey, it's up to your interpretation. You do whatever you want to do. So I'm just gonna say it's rain. And I'm gonna, I mean, what is this like? Light rain, partly cloudy, somewhat rain, rain at the night. I mean, there's literally tornado things there. This is hilarious, Walmart. What was y'all doing? when y'all made these like little decal things. There's a rainbow, which I guess is cool. Um, I'm sure there was a rainbow somewhere. I don't know if this is supposed to be used for like planning in the past or like, you know, memory planning or, you know, like, oh yeah, there was a rainbow on Tuesday. Let me put this rainbow down. Like what, what's supposed to be going on here? Um, I don't know if uh, forecasters will predict um, what do you call it? Um, a rainbow. It's going to be a rainbow in the sky today. Like, I, I don't, I don't know. Um, so I'm just going to put these rain decals and Hey, I'll rip it up if I see a rainbow, which I guess is a memorable thing. So I should be happy that Walmart, uh, was thoughtful enough. Thank you, Walmart. Or who's the people? Yeah. I say Walmart pin and gear, pin and gear from walmart.com. Um, yeah. I would like to use some more decorative stuff in here or some washi at the bottom. Um, I could use this nailed it there. I could use, what else? This is like a blue version of this pink and I could like cut it or something. I don't know. Let's see. I'm not, I'm not trying to uh, construct that right now. I really want uh, things to be minimal and I'm sure you desire that too. Um, let's see, I see birthday cake. So it's my brother's birthday on Saturday. And I have a friend's birthday that um, was on the 6th. Or is on the 6th. And then also a baby that's due. Not my, not my baby. <laughs> but a friend's baby that's due on the 6th as well. So um, let's see. I'm sure that baby's out. Congratulations. Um, let's see. What else is going on? And then Friday, my daughter wants to go to the Children's Museum. I told y'all about Chuck E. Cheese last week and um, how expensive that was and how shocking that was. And I spoke to another coworker uh, about that. And he said, yeah, I go with me and my wife and three daughters to Chuck E. Cheese and we spend over a hundred dollars. And I'm like, shock, shocking, like what? Like, Ch Chuck E. Cheese is is getting one hundred fifty dollars from full families. Like, really? And he was like, "Yeah," and the pizza and blah blah blah. He's telling me all this stuff, and I'm just like, "Am I missing something here? Like, is this like a thing? Like, have I been inside too long because of what's going on? That you know, I'm just totally missing it because I used to take my daughter to the museum all the time to like the the trampoline parks, and I think I'm gonna use these little stars to kind of do my top two things. What do y'all think about that? I'm sure there's something, I feel like there's something richer in color that is here. Sorry, I should be flipping this so y'all can kind of see. I mean, other than the check marks, those are rich in color. Uh, these little arrows, stars, there's too much white going on in there. I like color, but you know what? I'm probably gonna end up having to use the little things and that's gonna be okay. Because at first I was going through a bunch of Happy Planner uh, sticker books and stuff to see what matched this. And I was like, oh yeah, I can use this too. And, and honestly, I'm getting like really minimal over here. And I'm just like, you know what? No, we are not doing that. We are not going to other sticker books because this thing has like literally everything in there. Like literally every 
kind of thing I can think of and it will be fun to see what turns out with this like just by using this one book I should do like a one book challenge which I guess that's what I'm doing now and it's not very challenging at all because it has everything in it <laughs> and I hope you guys know like um when I'm off the camera literally I will add or day to day I'm adding more stickers to this stuff I'm sure you guys do that too or you'll sit there and be like oh yeah I have this it's so funny that we plan this way but honestly life can be a little bit boring and especially if you're a creative type like me that likes to do arts and crafts I was that kid with the easy bake oven everything uh they you know every kind of craft I used to sew and all that kind of stuff like my elementary school taught me how to um, knit, which is hilarious. Um, I really wanted to use these big, um, I was gonna put this like over here, but that's gonna take up a lot of space. And I honestly don't think that there's anything advantageous to that. Like, like there's no advantage for me to um, use that. Um, and I'm noticing the challenges that I'm having throughout the week. I really want to start working out, um, going back to doing yoga. Um, and I really want to start back to my morning walks. Um, whenever I drop my daughter off at school, I usually will go out and um, maybe I can use this fun. Where's the fun? I just saw fun. There's fun. There we go. Fun on Friday. Fun Friday. I can take this off because, I mean, the biggest highlight is her getting back to the museum because that's what she's been talking about the whole time. I wonder if I can put these here. If it's gonna, even if it takes up space, you'll see I will rip this up and I'll write down the stuff. Um, other things I like to write in here are like, if I'm gonna film or if, um, what is it? If um, the books that she's reading, my daughter's reading and books that I'm reading, which I have been, honestly failing and doing and that is okay I'll just pick it up again another time and I can just do that and that and y'all don't have there is some decals but yeah I need to get back to my fitness I need to get back to um doing all that kind of stuff and I'm pretty sure that is gonna um help me out in some areas too and I could probably start tracking that in here I've seen a lot of people track their fitness um, inside of here and be successful in that I wonder if that's something that I can do let me see if I have some happy planner stuff sorry I hope this video isn't going too long um, yeah I always like to put coffee at the beginning of the week but I mean I'm drinking I'm doing better <laughs> with using like my Keurig and things like that to save money instead of going to Starbucks but um, a lot of times and see I wanted to use this to do up here which I could rip that up and do but you know what I'm gonna leave it like that and that's fine I wonder if I have I don't know if y'all remember the sticker book now I'm looking through my sticker books the tiny here we go tiny the tiny happy planner and I have a bell on the floor because I was going through um my holiday stuff and I did this one last week but it was in another sticker book and I'm going to do it again this week take this up I don't know if I'm gonna use it or not use this arrow or not but I do like see now that gave me that gave me life <laughs> that made me so happy putting um my little put you back in such a sticker book and then also I wonder if there's something about reading in here there's a lot of stuff in this tiny sticker book that is so funny. I'm over here like, this gave me life. I was like, girl, are you serious? Um, let's see. Vacation. I need a vacation. Um, let's see. This month, the, the major things is it's my daughter's birthday at the end of the month. It is um, my brother's birthday actually this weekend. Um, and we're just getting back into the swing of things, honestly, which is great. I um, wonder if I should put this little why, why not, you know? I tried to use this as a tracker one time, and it does not work out as a tracker. Love that. I think it's just meant to be a decorative look. Is this rain or is this snow? 
<laughs> even happy planner was like hey maybe you need to use this as um rain or snow let's see i think that's it i was looking for um i had a book decal there but um my daughter is utilizing a lot of the stickers and she's six which is funny um but she's utilizing a lot of the like schoolwork stickers um and things like that so she's playing around with those sticker books um and having fun so i'm letting her have her best time and then i have meetings so i can use this i'll pull this out let's see i have a meeting on this day so i can just rip that up and rip this up too put that there and hmm, could put that to the side maybe um maybe i could put this in like a random place and then rip it up and use it where i need to use it and i think that's it for this week i mean i watch i'll find some kind of washi to put that put at this bottom and transform the whole thing and then i'll be like ah oh, i wish i would have like i could use something like this or like something neutral like this at the bottom but you know what i'm not and I, um, that's fine. I don't have to use it. So yeah, that's it for this week's um, weekly Hobonichi Weeks plan with me. And I'll probably come back and do this one as well. So that we'll be right on the money. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you're new here, please subscribe for more videos. And if you guys have any other recommendations for shops, please leave them below. I found a few, so some uh, new shops coming up soon. Um, all right, talk to y'all later. Ciao.